What's up, everybody? Welcome back to the game channel. My name is AJ Gels. How y'all doing? We are back with Gears Tactics. Now, uh, looks like we're going to be doing a side mission in this one. Aldair Control Phantom Warlord. Uh, hold both control zones for two or more consecutive turns. Um, I believe we get uh, from... It's It's been a little bit since I've last played this game. I've been focusing on other projects, so... Uh, forgive me if I forget exactly what happened at the very end of the last video, but we got a tooltip that basically said the way side missions work in this game are you can come that every character or hero or whatever can participate in one side mission in between every main mission. So it actually kind of keeps the main story moving and keeps you playing uh, all of that stuff. So Everyone here on our team can uh, participate in a side mission. I'm going to use this to really, um, really boost my my side characters or my other just general, my generic units, I guess. Because right now, I mean, as far as heroes go, we've got Gabe, Sid, so we've got our buddy Jack. Yeah, we got the Cole Train and uh, Michaela Dorn, our sniper. So, all of that. Uh, Michaela's got a couple... A couple points here. Oops, wrong button. Sorry about that, guys. I want skill tree. There we go. Uh, yeah, she has sharpshooter as a passive skill. Precision shot shoots plus 30% accuracy, 30% damage bonus. That's not bad. Shooting if the target is down or killed, the unit reloads. Ooh, both of those are pretty good. Yeah, I definitely want... Yeah, I definitely want Precision Shot. 10% critical, not bad. Not a bad passive skill. Can I get both of those? Can I get both Alpha and Omega? There we go. I believe I can. Man, I also... Man, I do want to pick up Fast Fingers, though. That's not bad. Because, I mean, Fast Fingers plus getting Alpha. Because that's down the target or kill the target and I get a free reload and I get 15% damage on the first bullet in the magazine. I think I'll take fast fingers now just to keep my, my sharpshooter firing. But when I, but the next skill that I'm going to get, I think I'm going to go alpha. Cause I think that makes more sense. Um, Next, let's look at Tyrone. He's got a couple skills. Oh, geez, I forgot. He's not had any level up. Um, shoot with a 30% critical bonus. Oh, definitely, I want that. This unit shoots, it gets one stack of anchor to a maximum of three. Unit, uh, so, so, so. Okay, okay. So basically, the heavy are all right. I, I haven't been working with a very strong understanding of anchor, so I get bonuses if I if I stand still. I mean that makes sense. Just it's nice to specifically know what that is. This unit gains fifteen percent critical hit chance after taking damage. Not bad. If I want to use them, kind of like a tank, I can get five sets of anchored. Ooh, strategic positions. Not bad. Ooh, that's also pretty good. Yeah, I'll take that. Um, I want to run through, make sure, you know, I'm going to do some modifications to everybody's gear real quick. Make sure everybody's um, all good to go. And, you know, uh, I'll even go through some of our just generic units and, you know, just kind of do cosmetic changes here or there. See what I like. Uh, so uh, I will be back with you guys in a second. All right, sorry for all the talking. I got everyone kitted out and, you know, dressed up the way I want. Um, let's remove this whole kit and caboodle. Let's kind of build our team from the ground up. So, see, this is a side mission. I'm probably going to want to use this time to start just kind of leveling my team. So, let's go for the lower level characters. So, there we go. Let's bring Michaela. She's at a level two. Let's bring Glenn as our support. Tyrone's at a level two. And Marcella should 
roll out this team. Yeah, actually, I, I, I like this group. I think this will work. I got some damage, got some healers, you know. I think I think it's a pretty well-rounded crew. Our uh, have located a pair of untapped supply caches in the AO. Lock down those sites and make sure the grubs don't wreck the party. There we go. I thought I'd have to read that. Okay. Heavy on standby. Here I go. Yeah, I'm gonna want to keep here. her up here. I mean, as long as they're not gonna come at us from that bridge. But yeah, I want to keep her up there so she can uh she can fire from the top of the bridge. Have uh. Nice line of sight on everyone. Um, in the event I didn't mention it, uh, pretty much all the changes I made to, you know, any changes I made to characters, it was all... Um, Ready. There we go. Let's turn on the TACCOM because I like having that on. Uh, any changes I made to characters were mostly cosmetic. I gave... Um, Holy crap, I gave her sniper some armor. I, why can't I remember her name? I said it like three seconds ago. They're moving in. Kayla. There we go. That's her name. But yeah, I gave her uh, some armor. That's that's just about it. Come Pretty much if they're gonna... You. Yeah, if they're gonna run right through there, they're gonna get, <laughs> get lit up. Send the support around. Kind of have him do the same thing. I'm moving for that uh, that yeah. chest of uh, chest of item items right now. I cannot speak today. Fuck. Wilco. Shouldn't be surprising if you've ever heard me, but. Uh. Area secure. Let's grab that one. Kind of throw Jack back here. Just kind of have him. Yeah, as usual, just have him cloak and hide. Moving out. Here we go. Grab some cover. He'll hit the uh, control point on the next turn. Wait to see what the locusts do there. Interesting. Not gonna charge. What was I about to say? They weren't gonna charge through the uh weren't gonna charge through here. I can't speak today. Fuck me. This is what happens when I start drinking coffee again and I skip the morning coffee. Scanning now. Okay. Oh, she's got... She's got four action points? Oh, I think that's, um... One of the gear items I gave her. I need to double check it, okay. but I'm pretty sure it's, uh... One of the... Uh, one of the items. Or one of the pieces of armor I gave her. Alright, I got 100%... Chance to hit. Uh, both are about the same. 
One potato. Two potato. Yep. Really, there's not much she can do other than just overwatch this area and kind of wait for him to come at her. I'm just kind of going to move Jack and, you know, just kind of nice and quietly up to that. Those items there. Just kind of cloak and, cloak and move. Package secured! Grab cover again. Let's see what they're gonna do. Not gonna try and help your buddy. Interesting. Oh, fudge. Uh, double fudge. Forward to this. Oh, you're kidding me. Hit chance fifteen percent. There's really not much I can do with him right now. Just dropping cover there and On it. try and defend yourself with an overwatch. I'm out. The meter. Yeah, and see she's back to Was I saying? Um, she's down to um, normal AP. Back to three AP for this turn. Yeah, I think that I think that uh, that four AP round was just a um, acknowledged. Anyone else? Eliminated. What was I saying? I think that 4 AP round was just lucky. It was a, uh, like I said, it was just an, a, um, a chance for that to hit. A chance for that to hit based on a piece of gear she was wearing. And we'll just drop cloak. I cannot wait to get Jack yep. weapons so he can do something all right um yeah i could give michaela an extra action but frankly i want to give her one more shot there we go i got one of them I think I killed that guy. I get the job done. All right. Roger that. Grab cover over here. I'll take this shot. Just do some damage. No one I can hit down here, so... If 
frankly, I'll just reload. Looks like they're coming down those stairs. So I'll duck around that cover. Setting up a you, they get to the bottom of those stairs, they're just getting blown away. Reloading. Ha! I'm good. Yeah. Uh-huh. Let's see here. Can I use precision shot for anything? God. I keep pressing the wrong button. Yeah, that could work. Not bad. I'm honestly a little surprised that hit. Oh, he's downed. I didn't think I downed him. Alright, time to bring Jack back over to uh, Tyrone. Have him give him some buffs and some backup down here. Because he's kind of fighting by himself. Sixty percent. You got it. Yeah, this is the better move because I can get over there. I can flank. I actually think my ch was my chance to hit worse there than it was. I don't think he can jump down there, so I'm just going to drop an overwatch right there, right in their faces. I use fast fingers so I can get the free reload. How the hell am I almost out? You're kidding me. I Ah, oh, so close. That'll work. Fire reload. Okay. You got it. Come up here. Anyone else? Do that. Uh, eliminate it. Do that. Here, give wingman. Yes, that's it. Drop targeting array. Shield. I'm just dropping all the buffs. Okay. And, of course, he can't execute. Can't chainsaw. Really can't do much of jack crap, so... Oh, there it is. I was like, I, I thought there was an end turn. Could not find the button. <laughs> yeah, that's what happens when you go the wrong way. Alright, not happy with some of those 
Those positions, I moved her out of there, but man, eh, it's fine. This will be good. Reload. All right, we'll start off with a reload. Roger that. It's gonna take all three actions really to get over there and. An Overwatch. Give him Wingman. Yeah, I think I can give multiple stacks for Wingman. Apparently, I got a. Uh, Oh, there we go. Hey, how you doing, guy? Yeah, you're dead, by the way. <laughs> All right, fine. You want to come down this way? We'll drop the Overwatch there. Here they come. Exactly what I thought they'd do. Really, you missed. All right. Let's start with a disabling shot. Cuz I got to interrupt that Overwatch. How much ammo I got? I got two more shots. There we go. Knowledge. Ah, because I haven't seen this in a while. Just finished mowing down those guys. Drop the Overwatch on that side. Time for a reload. Scout on standby. On it. Think we're good for now. Did Tyrone kill all the locusts on his side? Okay, never mind. Guess it doesn't matter. So once uh, once you collect enough supplies, it's automatic mission over. You don't have to collect them. There's no, oh, we can collect more than you have to. That's a cool map. And got a couple levels. Not bad, everyone. Not bad at all. Yeah, more troops. Yeah, we can claim all these. All these loot boxes. Eh, Delta armor. Hunter shell. Trooper helmet. Onyx helmet. Ooh. 
Overwatch stock and a drum mag. All right, well, let's go see what we can do with those. What's he got? He's got regulator armor to boost his evasion. Um, you know what? I think yeah, I'll give I'll give him the Delta kit. Uh, champion when this unit executes an enemy, each ally is healed for 10%. That's not bad. You know what though? If I'm going to have auto loader, I guess it doesn't really help to have that much ammo on him. That at least that's my thinking. Um, shadow, when this unit is in cover and not flanked, it gets 5% evasion. That's not bad. But I already automatically get 10% evasion with the boots that I'm currently wearing, so I'll keep that. Uh, he's got the veteran armor, 30 health. You know what? I'll keep that 30 health there. I'll probably give that other bit to someone else. Do I... Unit gets 10% maximum health. That's not bad. Yeah, I think I'm just going to keep building him up as a just a massive tank. Um, is there a way to... There we go. Huh, so I can have him be sleeveless, but alright, so I can have him wear the helmet and turn off so I can still see his beautiful face. I figured I could, but I thought it was worth asking the question. Uh, she's obviously getting the optics for the boosted critical. Well, is a base 3% critical? I mean, I, I know it's good to give crit to your snipers, typically. Only got one kill. Although I guess downs don't... Are, are Yeah, I guess downs aren't considered kills. I think maybe actually giving her the helmet would be better to give our shotgunner the critical. Yeah, I think... I Actually, I think that's... I gotta turn off show helmet. But yeah, I think giving her the critical... Oh, that's cool. I didn't realize that that's what show accessories did. Um, you know what? Actually, yeah, I like the kind of like the bare sleeves. Um, yeah, the commando pants. I'd lose health. Mm, no, I think, you know, for a shotgunner, I think, yeah, I think what she has is better. Uh, what does commando knee pads do? Gets more evasion. Eh, it really doesn't help him. Yeah, I think he'll get the commando knee pads. I think that'll help him more than just the normal commando shins. And... Ooh, he automatically does... What stock does... I didn't see the stock upgrade. What stock does he have? He's got the sleek stock for boosted crit chance. Although I like the... I like patrol. Yeah, I, I like patrol. So I'm going to give him patrol... Um, yeah, I'm not going to give him the drum mag. Everything else is equipped correctly. Um, I'm, I'm sorry if this is boring, you guys. I just, I, I, I like this aspect of these games, so I'm just kind of, you know, I'm trying, I'm trying to do a nice mixture of show you guys stuff and then. Okay, yeah, so, okay, so he's got the sleek stock equipped. Uh, give him the drum mag. Alright, there we go. So, you know, I'm, I'm not going to do this every episode, but I'm trying to give you guys a, kind of a mix of showing you my thought process on upgrades and whatnot. At the start of your turn, you get 10% critical hit chance. The effect ends the time you hits a critical shot. Ooh, although I lose damage for losing... Yeah, I'm gonna... Yeah, damage is more important. 
extended mags good. Yeah, she's got a good weapon. I didn't see what I could give him. The holographic handle. Uh, yeah, keep the power handle. You want to keep the power handle. Um, all right, I think all that stuff's done. All that's left is the skill tree. And give him payback. Uh, yeah, that's pretty good. And strategic position. When this unit takes a shot at a target that are not in cover or are... Okay, yeah, okay. So it basically just gives us higher chance to crit. Yeah, that's that's a good, good ability for him. Even though I'm probably not going to be moving too terribly much, I don't think that's a... Huh, so okay. So he's, I guess, fitting into the artillery. Yeah, right there. You see level three artillery. Because that's where he's leaning more. I'm wondering if anybody else is. Yeah, he leans towards a paladin. Jack is a frontline bot. Yeah, he leans towards shock trooper. And Gabe leans towards, co leans towards combat medic. There we go. I promise you, I can speak the English language. So I'm very good at it. Uh, this unit gets 5% accuracy for this turn. Uh, that's not bad. Especially for a low... Accuracy gun like a shotgun. Uh, this unit gets two actions. Takes damage equal to 30% of this. Uh, I don't like that. I want to see if I'm... Am I re this unit gets two actions. This unit takes damage equal to 30% of this unit's maximum health. I am not a fan of that. Um, you know what? Because this will actually give us reasons to use that cloak ability more. So yeah, so I can shoot while hidden. I get bonus damage. Yeah, that gives us more incentive to use the uh, to use that ability. Yeah. Uh, all right. Well, now that you've seen me hem and haw on all that shit for uh, so long, uh, next video we'll hop into the next main mission. Uh, we have an optional objective of complete the mission in 15 turns or less. Or 15 turns or less. Like I said, I swear to God, I can speak. Uh, Michaela's people report that Ukon has been uh, frequenting a warehouse in Aldair's packing district. Search uh, the site for clues about his operation. Uh, Gabe and Michaela are the only required. And we get weapon mods and common weapon mods for completing the mission. So, um, we'll start the video in this screen uh, for the next one, I want to say, as always, guys, thanks so much for watching. Social media is in the description. Like, comment, if you're not already. Please subscribe to the channel. Stay tuned more next time. Until then, my name's AJ Gels. This is Something Game Channel. I'm out.